Hello? Yes, my friend. Go ahead. We hear you. You are live. You are a Muslim? Yeah. To be honest with you, I cannot debate a Muslim. You tell me, what do you like me to ask you? You see, because you are very smart and you are very, you know, I mean, scary. Tell me the question and I will repeat the question as it is to you. <laughs> okay. Um, my question to you is, uh, how do you know that Jesus is God? How do you know that Jesus is God? Is that the question you like me to ask you or this is a question you like me to ask myself? I want you to um, answer that question uh, to the best of your knowledge. All right. Well, I will, I will, I will, um, I will answer you, my friend. So let us go and see how we can answer this question. By the way, you gave me a very hard question. I don't know. Is it okay if I call a friend or I should do it by myself? Well, I mean, if you can do it yourself, that would be very helpful. That's wonderful. Thank you very much. You know. All right, my friend. Do you believe in the Quran? <clears throat> Um, I've had my doubts. Oh, okay. So you are a Muslim, but so so. Yeah, exactly. All right, that's wonderful. I encourage you to have more, more, more of so so. We go in the Quran. Okay, why friend, you if, we, if we go in the Quran, the Quran yeah. says the following. Mm -hmm. Do you speak Arabic? No. Oh, that's okay. Then we will read the translation. Yeah. Chapter four, verse number one seventy one. Okay. Okay. If we go there, we will find the following: the Quran confirm yeah. that Jesus the Christ is the son of a woman. Her name is Mary. You agree with that? Yes, I do. And then he is Allah Messenger. Do you agree with that? Yes. Okay. And then he says, and he is His Word. Do you agree with that? Um. What do you mean he is his word? Uh, don't ask me. The Quran says that. The Quran says, and Jesus, Jesus is the son of Mary, and he is a messenger, and he is his word, which means the word of Allah. Do you agree with that? Can you get the narration up, please? Well, his, his word. You can go, you can go up right now and see the narration. This is this is Quran, what I will do for you. I mean, now you want to read the interpretation, you mean? Yes. Well, the, the word of Allah is the word of Allah. Allah, he speaks words, he says words, you know. So he is the word of Allah, as simple as that. Now, and then he continues saying, which he bestowed on Mary. So this word, mm -hmm. this word is coming from where? It's coming from heaven. Okay. Okay. So we agree, me and you, that he is his word, and as long as he is his word, so he's coming from heaven on Mary. Oh. And spirit yep. proceeding from him. Spirit, Jesus Christ, is a spirit proceeding from him. That's true. Okay. Yeah. So you agree with that? I do. All right. So let us me, me and you organize things together. Focus on you. Okay. Please. Jesus is focus. the messenger. All right. I will I will yeah. I will do this. I'm going mm -hmm. I'm going to copy the point one by one, the one we agree upon, me and you. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So Jesus is the messenger of Allah. I'm going to copy that and I will paste it on the screen so we can yeah. count, count with the things we agree upon. Okay. All right. So he is first the messenger of Allah. Okay. Yeah. Second, he is he is his word. He is his word. Bestowed yeah. Mary, which means he is yeah. coming. He is coming from heaven. Yeah. Okay. So you agree on that? That's wonderful. That's, I feel like making a logical leap there. Okay. Well, we are going me and you together to see yeah. what is logical and what we agree upon first before we see our differences. Correct. That's that's okay. that's a better yeah. way, right? And then it says, that's and he is a spirit. Proceeding from him. All right. Okay. Okay. So now I didn't know. I didn't know. I didn't know he said that. It says in the in the verse in the front of us, chapter four, verse one seventy one. Yeah. Okay. So now okay. those those are three things. And by the way, you are welcome to call me anytime. Sound like you are a nice gentleman and you are not a rude person, and I like that. So okay. let us let us me and you. Uh, uh, what I can call you, Muhammad? What is your name? Um, you could call me Adam. Adam, okay, Adam. So the 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 Quran confirm in the front of us three things, as you see, that Jesus mm -hmm. first, he is a messenger of God, which means he's a man. Yes. Then he is the word of God. Now you agree with me that the word of God is coming from heaven, right? Well, that's where God is. So yes. Yes, that means Jesus is the word of God coming from heaven. So Jesus is not from this earth. In the Bible, Jesus said. My kingdom is not in this earth. I am from above, and that confirmed mm. what Jesus said that he's from above. So Jesus, before he became a man, he what he was? He was a word. 
Yeah. And that word became a man. His name is Jesus. Okay. We agree? Okay. So Jesus, who was the word of God in heaven, he came to earth as a man. And then that word, it says here that he is in the same time, he is a spirit proceeding from him, which means from Allah. Yeah. Okay. okay. Now, you speak English very well, I guess, better than me. Proceeding. Do you see the I in G? Yes. Okay. Proceeding. When I say, from. Okay. When I say proceeding using the I in G, it's mean this is something continues, right? Yes, if it's proceeding, yeah, yeah, okay. it's always that's continuing. Mean, that's mean always the spirit of Jesus is proceeding from Allah, spirit. Hmm. And now you tell me if Jesus is God or not. How Jesus is coming from above, how Jesus is the word of God, how Jesus is spirit yep. proceeding from God, yet he's not God. How that can be possible? That's a good point you make, to be honest with you. Um, At the same time, my friend, Adam, same time yeah you see the second we say that he was a word in heaven that means jesus is exist before he was created as a man that's true well that's wonderful jesus said before abraham i am this is in total agreement with the bible when jesus he said before abraham i am which means my existence have nothing to do with my birth yeah but here it, here it confirmed <laughs> that I don't, it, don't you see it's confirming that he was a word before he became a man but the thing is that you don't even believe in the Quran, do you? Yeah, my friend, you see, I'm showing you from the Quran because you believe in the Quran, not me. Oh, you, your, your position is that the Quran is full of no, logical. I'm trying, content. I'm trying to show you how. You see, when I speak to somebody, believe, yeah. believe in yoga, I have to talk to him mm. in the language of the yoga, which he understand. When I speak to somebody yeah. is a Hindu, I have to speak to him based on what he believed. Everybody, every one of us have a background. If I go right now and sit with a farmer, what he knew, he knew yeah. how, how to dig in the ground, put a tree, he knew better than me than that. So I have to talk to him based on what he knew, based on what he believed in, not based on my belief or my philosophy. So I'm coming to you, I'm coming to you, and you see now we, we, have, a, we have a common ground in this point yeah. now that you and me ac accept. And now we have a better way and to understand how Jesus can be God. If the Quran yeah. confirmed that he was the word of God before he came to earth, then now you need to ask yourself the question how he was in heaven and the quran by the way it says his name what do you remember the verse when the, the angel he came to mary and he said to her I, I i am here to 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 announce to you the gift of holy son his name is isa mm. so he have a name as isa before even he was born mm. so isa was well, isa was in heaven as a word of god but he is not a man yet mm. in chapter 19 verse 19 it says I am here to announce to you the gift of a holy son, which means Jesus was a holy in heaven. Okay, who is the one who made Mary Bretnet? Well, um, according to all traditions, it's um, it's the spirit of God, isn't it? No, it's God. Okay, the spirit cannot create. There is nothing. Nobody can create save Allah, correct? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So who is the one who made Mary Bretnet? Allah. Yeah, well, it okay. Would, so yeah, now, yeah. if we ask Christians, he they say to you, Jesus is a son of God. Why? Yeah. Because who is the father of Jesus? Based on on our logic, is God. See. So now we confirm. Yeah. If we ask you now, as a Muslim, why hmm. Jesus only is the only person who is born of a woman, but he don't have a father? You can't explain that it, to me. It is very significant. You are, you are correct. All right. So what what, what the point then? Obviously, there is a God. Don't do things for no reason. There's a reason. What is the reason? Obviously, he's trying to show us something. Otherwise, uh, Jesus should be the same. Why Muhammad have have a mother and father? Why Moses have a father and mother? Why Abraham? He have all of them. Uh, Abraham is is a great great man in in the in the history of Christianity, even in Islam. So why all of them they have normal parents, and after generation and generation, only one person in the whole universe is born. But yet he don't have a father. What the point? Mm, this is obviously it's a very unique occurrence. Especially, my friend, if I if I say now to you, my mother she gave birth to me, but she was she was a virgin. I mean, there's no proof or disapproved, correct? I mean, there's no point of this uh, miracle. Yes, that's true. Because anyone can claim your mother can claim same. My mother she can claim the same, and this would be funny. So, what the point of saying that Mary she have no man? 
making such an incredible miracle when nobody can prove it the purpose of miracles is to make people believe is that correct yes to show the power of God okay but this is a miracle nobody can see nobody can witness yeah it is something behind doors there's no no need for it unless okay. unless there is something behind that idea that this person is not from this earth and he is the son of no man mm. and that's why and that's why Jesus is God okay what okay do you, what do you think it's a lot to take in to be honest with you um I'm, I'm following your logic however so because um, I yeah I'm, I'm open-minded so um uh although I've been raised in Muslim, uh, it's, it's obviously not in concrete you know um I'm, I've got my own question and there was one of my questions as to why you believe Jesus to be God um, to be honest with you um I, I follow your logic well my friend there's not not only it's about logic you see if we say just a logic then uh, uh, uh you know we we need the uh, i don't know how to explain it to you you see when we say there's god he made a tree hmm. then why he made a tree the tree is not made just to be there the tree is made for a reason so if yeah. you if you, look, if you if you look at the complex of the earth how it is you will see everything complete each other right yeah the insects are there for a reason the snake is there I for do. a reason the cats yeah. the rats the dogs everything every person every human every insect every creature is exists for a reason now mm. the existence of jesus in such a situation shouldn't we ask ourselves what is the reason yeah i do ask my i do ask myself that question to be honest that's wonderful you. why why the jesus in the quran is called the holy the muslim they say to us how god can be born of a woman which means he's you know she gave birth to him from her private part and they think this is an insult you see god is always holy even the quran in chapter 19 verse 19 it says that i am here to announce to thee the, 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 the holy son so jesus even he's born of a woman from her private part even the quran confirmed that he's holy so the muslim here they have hypocrisy when they want they remember that jesus is a person who is born of a you know women private part when they when they mm -hmm. want they ignore and they forget that jesus is holy how jesus is just a prophet like everybody but he never commits sin how Jesus is a prophet like everybody, but he is coming from heaven. And now he is going back to heaven. He's in heaven right now, correct? That's what the Muslims say. According to the word, uh, you are correct. Yeah, so why why Jesus is in the heaven? Why not Muhammad? The Muslims, they say mm. Muhammad is the greatest prophet. Do you think the greatest man to Allah, he will be in the grave? And the one who is this great, he will be next to Allah right now? Well, if I think of it from my perspective, if I have someone who is very dear to me, um, I would want them with my son. See, so if, if Muhammad is the greatest, he should be now with Allah, not in the grave. Mm. Right? Now, Jesus, mm. the person who is a living person for thousands of years, is that a human to live for thousands and thousands of years until judgment day? Is that a human? No, obviously. No, no. Obviously, it's not. So even the Quran, mm. in every step, every word, every line, confirmed to us that Jesus is a miraculous person. Even, even the Quran confirmed when Jesus, he was born he spoke in the cradle do you agree with the quran say say that last word again jesus he spoke in the cradle oh yes yes that's okay. correct muhammad he waited for 40 years to receive inspiration of allah and he did not even talk to him he sent him a guy his name is jibreel is that correct and he also received it from angel Gabriel. all right so why jesus in the first day of his life he spoke as a prophet and took muhammad 40 years to be a prophet shouldn't we ask ourselves why jesus did not wait for jibreel to teach him even the hadith confirm that allah he made a plastic surgery for muhammad and he installed a dish of wisdom and dish of faith in his chest mm. and i think you know the story right yeah okay why allah did not need to do plastic surgery for isa to install a dish of faith and dish of wisdom why isa is born with knowledge do you know why? Well, because he's special. No, because simply, my friend, he is the word of God. So you're telling me the word became flesh? My friend, yes, he is the word of God. This is why the word of God is the knowledge. He do not need a knowledge. So, so why... let me just follow your theology. Huh? So you're saying basically 
because he is the word and he became flesh, therefore, because God is perfect, Jesus never sinned in his life. This is what the Bible says, but I'm showing it to you based on the Quran, trying to make it close to your mind, based on mm. your understanding, based right. on your belief. You know, so Jesus, why Jesus did not wait for Jibreel to learn? A question that I've always had here. Yeah? So, so again, um, say again, please. Can I, I just going to raise a question? I've always had this in my mind. Yeah. All right. Um, it is the essentially this is one thing that's gotten me so so. Um, well, if God has, if Allah, okay, has said that He has sent down all all virgins. Yeah. So He sent down the Torah. He sent down the Injil, and then he sent down the Quran. Um, my question is, I mean, why did he wait um, so long uh, to tell people that Christianity is false? That's a good question. This is, that's a good question, my friend. But not only that. You see, even the Quran cannot be considered as a book to tell us that Christians or Christianity is false. Why? Because read with me carefully, my friend. If we go hmm. in the Quran, you will find the following. Muhammad, in the mm. beginning of his life, he said this when he, in the beginning of his, uh, let us say, a prophethood, he claimed to be a yeah. prophet. He said the following: that those who they are Jews and those who they are Christian and those who they are Sabian, they have nothing mm. to worry about and they will go to heaven. Chapter two, verse yeah. number sixty-two. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that's true. That. Okay, yeah. how, how we say that Christianity is false, and then he, in his time, he's a promising the Christians. And the Jews and the Sabians to go to heaven. Saying is he's promising everyone heaven. Absolutely, and not only that, he's promising the Sabian who worship stars. So you're making him seem as though he was just trying to recruit. He was trying to make himself accepted in, for everybody, like Obama during the election, like in America. You know, uh, uh, the, uh, the, when when people they speak to atheists, he plays as an atheist. When when the mm. when, when the one who want to support him is a gay, he say I have no problem with gay. When he speak to Christian, he say to them I love the Bible. When he speak to Muslims, he said to them, the Prophet Muhammad was amazing. So they have many colors. They have many, many, uh, you know, forms because they are deceivers. If Muhammad mm. is a decent man, Muhammad is a decent prophet, and he believe in, 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 in what you just said, that the Christians are corrupt, then how he promised the Christians? Who, who are yeah, they? Right. Muhammad yeah, in this time, Muhammad in this time, he's talking to people who they are around him, not people who they are passed away. Mm. He said the Christians, the Jews and the Sabian. Mm. All they yeah, have nothing said, to worry about. Yeah. They go, but look what happened when Muhammad he gave up that the Jews will not accept him, the Christians are not accepting him. Then he starts focusing on killing the Jews and the Christian, not the Sabian. So, if in history, yeah, because you seem like a very knowledgeable man to be honest with you, in history, um, did many Christians accept Islam? Well, how it, don't you see me how much I'm accepting Islam? No, of course, you have not. So oh, until now, my friend, until now, my friend, until now, after the occupation of Islam to the Middle East, there is about between 10 to 15 percent of those countries are Christians, which means they are resisting badly after all the humiliation, paying jizya, forcing them, you know. Until mm -hmm. now, there is between 10 to 15 percent are Christians. And that is telling you how much they will not, they reject Islam. And now for sure, during during the occupation, there's people who they are going to be weak. Like imagine if ISIS came to this town, your town or my town, and say, yeah. everybody, everybody have to be like us. Who dare to say no? Nobody, right? Mm. You agree? Yeah. Nobody. They will kill yeah. you. They will slaughter you with no mercy. This is what Muhammad yeah. is. Muhammad is ISIS. And Muhammad, he gave him an option. In order to live and stay as a Christian, no problem. Pages here. So people they prefer yes. they prefer to be the jizya but not to convert. So what you're saying is that you believe that ISIS follows the Sunnah of the Prophet. My friend, ask yourself a question. You sound like a very intelligent man. Name for mm -hmm. me one thing ISIS did Muhammad did not do. Just one. To be to be honest with you, um, I see a lot of similarities, but um, obviously it was a different time. My friend, my friend, you see when ISIS he slaughtered a person, he caught the Quran. When he killed mm. a person, he called the Hadith. They are truly, truly true Muslims. That's that's a valid point you make. You see, to be honest. In, in order for ISIS person, you see, I, the, those who join ISIS, they are not, uh, you know, they're they, not they, they, they call, they, they, they they call them brainwashed. They call them brainwashed. But the fact it is that they believe in what Muhammad did. This is the truth. Nobody want to say the yeah, truth. They, 
محمد yeah, محمد هي كل محمد هي كيدناب محمد هي ستيل محمد هي اتاك كارفان محمد هي توك ومن محمد هي توك تشيلدرن از سليفز محمد هي فورس تو بي جزيا محمد هي اف فورس ان سليفري سو وات وات محمد هي كات هاندز محمد هي بوت نيلز ان ذا ايز اوف ذا بيبول محمد هي كرسفاي بيبول محمد هي سلاتر بيبول محمد هي ريب ومن نيم فور مي وان ثينج محمد ديد ايسيس از نوت دوين ذي ار جاست اكشلي ايسيس ار فيري نايس كومبير تو محمد There's many ugly things Muhammad did, ISIS did not do. You know, we cannot compare. Actually, there, there was a video made by a secular Muslim. They called him moderate Muslim. He was trying that to prove that ISIS are not true Muslim. Do you know how he did it? I don't know if you saw the video. He was saying no. that when ISIS, they enter a town in Syria, the, mm -hmm. the town was a Catholic town, Christian Catholic. Okay. He was showing a video of ISIS meeting with those catholic in a church taking them as a slaves and saying to them you have one of two choices the prophet he taught us either you pay the jizya or we will kill you all he said uh -huh. that the moderate muslim saying if isis was a true muslim should not accept to make them pay the jizya and he explained no. why he said because in that church those catholic they have a statues of mary and based on that, those are not considered to be part of the jizya payment. So the moderate Muslim saying that ISIS are not a true Muslim because they did not slaughter everyone in that church. That's quite silly, isn't it? See, but so, but this is how they prove that ISIS are not Muslim when they speak in Arabic. But when we speak in English, the story is different.